Okay guys, how are we doing? We've got some more Destiny gameplay here. Um, this is my third mission, I believe, after the elusive second mission that I uploaded on my first Destiny gameplay, where uh, where I landed on Old Mother Earth and had a little scout around trying to find some wreckage from an old ship and managed to find myself down this little entrance to a, a, a sort of underground well type thing. And there was the Sword of Crota guys, much to the dismay of that gunfight to the people who watched that video who were like, man, that was so painful to watch. <laughs> it was just, I walked in there too soon. I didn't understand what I was doing and that was the direction I was headed towards. And uh, yeah, I kind of, it's a case of running before you can walk. And uh, unfortunately it was, a, it was a messy gunfight, but I managed to win it in the end. And for what reward, I don't know. I just got this sword for a little while before it vanished into thin air. So I obviously, I took some feedback from the people who watched that video and some people enjoyed the video and said, look, what you need to do is get back to the tower and upgrade your weaponry. Just keep going back to the tower, upgrade your weaponry, upgrade your armor, and you'll have an easier fight every time you come across these guys. So that's what I did. And uh, one thing I found, you know, I'm starting to understand it a bit more. One thing I found was I'd managed to find these boots or acquire these boots somehow. And I believe they were required for a level 4. You know, you, re you were required to be a level 4, basically. So, went over to this guy and he said he could... I don't know, he did some kind of conjuring thing. I think he could release the inner power of these boots because they were unusable. And uh, he was in the tower and I gave them to him and he performed some sort of spell or something, if I remember rightly. And then they became equipable, but the problem was I was a level 3. So I thought, well, I need to obviously go off get into some more battles and boost my level up to a level 4 because the problem is you go back to the tower there's so many things you can do but being a level 3 everything's just closed off to you you know all the kind of tournament type things are all closed off and uh, yeah so that's what I did so I headed back down to old Russia Earth and uh, I went to do this one mission where uh, you've got to find this hive wizard which is who I come across in a moment but in the meantime I'm faced with these thralls and acolytes you know these low level enemies who just don't really take much shooting to kill until I bump into this wizard who does take a little bit more doing and that's uh, that's where the story is at the moment so yeah I was battling it out with him and he didn't cause me too many problems because I kind of held it back and bobbed and weaved while he threw his minions at me as I took them to pieces one by one and just tried to get off as many shots as I could this gun I want to get another gun I do want to get some more weaponry I'm not sure about how the upgrading on weaponry goes I'm sure you can do it as you go on but uh, I've noticed there are some other weapons that I do want and he, for some reason he won't let me have them so I'm assuming I need to be more levels higher levels to get those but you know he took the shots and it took a long time to get him down and uh, eventually I succeeded thank god the only worst bit of damage I managed to do was to myself because I'm a complete noob for you guys who watch my noob of the week intro you'll see that one where the guy throws the grenade at the wall and on the uh, on the intro that's exactly what I did here as you'll see when uh, I go to throw a grenade and I throw it through what I believe is the window and it actually bounces back and nearly kills me and it's a complete nub move because just before I go into this tunnel for this gunfight it comes up that there's no respawning available and I thought shit I better I better do a good job of this so yeah enjoy the gameplay now I just wanted to talk about my last destiny upload because you know it kind of got mixed reviews because there were some people who were really happy to see a destiny upload a lot of people are really into it and obviously want to see me progress and see how I do and how I deal with it and also there were some people who were like look this really isn't for me you know I can't believe you're playing destiny I find it quite dull and boring and I understand that it's a game that you play with parties and teams and it, you know, it becomes a little bit more interesting and obviously if you get some higher level people with you, it makes your adventure a lot more simpler and a lot more rewarding and I suppose you rank up a lot quicker. I at the moment, when I was playing this, I did have a look online to see if anybody was playing Destiny and there was nobody playing at that time, otherwise I'd have invited some people in and said help me get through this, <laughs> help me beat the Hive Wizard who's taking so many shots from this pathetic gun that I have. And, uh, and yeah, so yeah, people were sort of mixed about the video. I think the thing is that I've been such a Call of Duty channel for so long, even when I ventured out to upload some Battlefield, people were like, whoa, Battlefield, what, what is this? <laughs> it's almost like I've introduced some foreign buddy into the channel. And it's like I said before, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to branch out, I'm trying to try more things. But don't be mistaken, the, you see, one of the annoying thing was the, the video got a lot of dislikes. And I can only assume 
the only reason people dislike the video I would like to believe is because it was a Destiny gameplay and nothing else. And you know, man, that would be don't. You know, I know it sounds pathetic, but don't dislike the video just because it's Destiny and it's not Call of Duty. If it's not for you and Destiny isn't your thing, then you know, you don't have to watch it. Nobody's subjected to have to watch my videos. I implore you not to watch it if it's not for you. Um, there's going to be a lot more games coming on here that aren't going to be for everybody, but somebody somewhere out there will enjoy what I do and they'll like to see my perspective of it. So, you know, it's the same with Battlefield. My Battlefield videos actually do better than I thought, but there's the fraternity of um, Call of Duty players who just don't want to see Battlefield. So, you know, don't, don't leave a dislike. It gives the wrong messages across. It sends the wrong signals altogether because it makes me think, is my commentary wrong? Am I going about this the wrong way? And then I'll probably end up changing something that maybe didn't need changing in the first place. And um, the other good thing about it was I actually gained quite a few more subscribers from doing the Destiny. So, you know what? It's a good way to grow my channel, I suppose, is to branch out into different areas. It gives a, it gives a better option to people to, you know, come across my videos and say, oh, this guy's uploading Destiny. I like the sound of him. I'll, uh, I'll subscribe to this as opposed to just having constant Call of Duty videos out there. And it's, uh, it's kind of a one-trick pony sort of thing. And I don't want to be a one-trick pony. I want to have many tricks. I want to be able to juggle and ride a unicycle and swallow a flaming sword. <laughs> so, um, yeah, not that I'm into deep-throating stuff, but you know what I mean. So, yeah, eventually I managed to defeat the bloody wizard. The hive wizard is defeated, and um, it says mission ended. See, it's like I say, I'm still learning about these things, because it sort of says your mission has ended, and uh, it gives you a countdown. I was kind of, you know, trying to summon my ghost to say, where do I go now? Where do you leave me to go? But it just sort of pulls you out anyway, and teleports you back to the ship. Of which, uh, after this, I go back to the tower and I manage to be able to equip the boots and um, upgrade a few other bits and pieces, which I was really pleased about. So yeah, the progression continues, and uh, thanks to the people who welcomed me to the grind of Destiny, I hope that uh, I hope that my uploads will please you in some way. And like I say to the guys who don't like Destiny gameplay, and certainly won't like the other things I throw away, please don't dislike, just don't watch if it's not for you. I won't be offended, I really won't. This is for the people who want to see it. It's as simple as that. By the way, I forgot to say yesterday, Happy New Year to everybody. I hope you all had a happy holiday, and uh, may the new year bring you everything you desire, all the riches and all the health and wealth that it can. Just leave a little bit for me. Apocalypse done.